What is up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Stally111, and this is Pokemon X and Y news. This is uh, episode 5, I believe, and we've got two new Pokemon that I've not talked about today. Uh, I've not talked about at all today. Uh, sorry we couldn't get any news for the new Pokemon that's been announced in the new Japanese trailer known as Uber Auto. Um, nothing's been announced. So the first Pokemon I'm going to be talking about today, they're both fairy types, but uh, it's Swirlix. Swirlix is his uh, English name. His Japanese name is, uh, again, mind my, my. Sorry for my pronunciation, but uh, his Japanese name is Peruf Perufu. Hey, uh, Perapu. Ah, uh, I can't speak. Uh, Peru. Peropafu. Peropafu. Sorry, took me a little bit to say that, but its type is Fairy Classification. It's a cotton candy Pokemon, as you can probably see from its appearance. Uh, height, as usual, it's meters, is 0 0.4. Uh, weight, uh, we're going for kilograms again, 3.5. And ability, uh, only one has been announced. Sweet Veil, or Veal, depending on if you're American or English, or, or uh, British. Uh, so it's Veil for me. First appearance is Pokemon X and Y. These are all new Pokemon. Uh, details: This fluffy Pokemon has revealed uh, has was revealed in August issue of Koro Koro. Uh, it is exclusive to Pokemon X. So yeah, that's another exclusive for you guys. Uh, entry: Swirlix only eats sweets, causing its body to be sweet and sticky. Like cotton candy, sweet and sticky. Uh, okay, moving on swiftly. No moves, only is draining kiss, which I don't recall from previous games. Maybe it was in. I've just not played enough of it. So the next Pokemon I'm going to be talking about today. Well, it, it's Sprit or Spritzy. That's uh, English name is Spritzy. Uh, Japanese name is uh, Shushup or Shushup. Uh, again, min, pr uh, mine, don't mind my pronunciation. It is another fairy type Pokemon, new type. Classification is a perfume Pokemon. Height is 0 0.2 meters. It's even smaller than the cotton candy one. Uh, the weight is 0 0.8, uh, 0 0.5, sorry, <laughs> my bad. Reading the wrong thing. 0 0.5 kilograms. Ability is healer. And that kinda, kinda is self-explanatory it's going to be able to heal itself. So a fairy, I believe, is going to be similar to the grass type Pokemon with the similar moves as Absorb and uh, Mega Drain and Drain and such like. Uh, Leech Seed, you know, the ones that heal your Pokemon, but maybe it's going to be a whole new different thing. Maybe it's even more powerful or less um, OP. Uh, so details. Um, it's a bird Pokemon, if you hadn't realised. It is it is a classification of a bird. You can see on both sides it's small, small, but they're wing, they are wings. Uh, this bird Pokemon was revealed in August issue of Korra Korra. Uh, it is exclusive to Pokemon X, so we got two new uh, exclusives to each individual Pokemon game. Entry. It emits unique fragrance that causes anyone, anyone who smells it to fall under its spell. That could be useful, and that could be very, very useful. No moves is uh, aromatherapy, which probably will cause uh, the enemy Pokemon to fall asleep, or even use moves against it to damage itself, or could even fall into confusion. Uh, so thanks, this is a short episode, but we don't have enough Pokemon or anything news, really, to talk about. So the uh, next episode will be on the Pokemon Uroto, you've probably heard of it by now if you are a Pokemon fan. But I'm tr tr still trying to wait for some information, like abilities, weight, classification. It's probably going to be a, a grass type, uh, from what it looks like. Um, or something similar, uh, maybe, nah, it's not going to be rock. Gr ground or grass, I would say, but uh, also I mean, it's this English name as uh, obviously I speak in English, so I need to know that. So thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. You've been a great audience for this short series of Pokemon news. And please go down and pop a like if you've enjoyed getting this information and uh, you you find this information useful. So thanks and peace.
comment anything that you think that I need to know that I've not already said that you found it from some source that is valid and legit. Thank you and stay classy.